What is up, YouTube? This is Jim with JimLopez.com. I get asked all the time, how to use AI writing tools? Just kidding. Nobody's asked me, but it's a very popular search term. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to use an AI writing tool. So without further ado, let's get started. There are many AI writing tools on the market, but in this video, I'm going to show you how to use one that's uh, real easy to use. It's one of my favorites, and I got plenty of videos on SEO writing.ai. So if you want to try it out, you can actually try it out for free. Uh, but let's go ahead and uh, once you create an account, you would start right here in the dashboard. So uh, first question you would have is what type of article you're looking to write. So if you're looking to write an SEO optimized blog post, you can use the one click blog post right here. And then the next one is the uh, bulk article generation. So this is if you're looking to write uh, up to 100 articles at once. And then they also have right here for your regular blog post, which you would follow their step by step, their product roundups, product reviews, product list workflows, how to guides, and then a simple editor. But for this video, I'm going to show you how to use their one click blog post. So you would just click the one click blog post here and you have the main keyword. So whatever you're writing about, you got to know your main keywords. So I use a tool called KW Finder. And for this example, we got the meal prep hacks, which has low difficulty and a good search search volume. So I'm going to go ahead and use this one here. And this is going to be our main keyword for this article. So I'm going to go ahead and paste it there. It's going to go ahead and generate a title. So right here we have meal prep, meal prep hacks, save uh, time saving tips for busy cooks. So the first thing we come down here, we're going to answer some questions. So you have your language. So depending on what language you want to write your article, you can see here they have all these different uh, languages. I'm going to leave it in English and then you got to figure out what article size you want to write about. So right here we have article size, small, extra small, small, medium, large. So we'll go ahead and just do a small for here. Then you have the tone of voice. So you get to pick the different tone of voice. You can do friendly, professional, informative. I'm going to go ahead and do informative. We got the point of view. So you could do first person, second person, third person. I'm going to go ahead and do first person singular and then target country. I'm going to do United States, uh, depending on the SERPs, uh, meaning the search ter uh, terms that are ranking. You can pick whatever country. I'm going to go ahead and, like I said, keep it United States. And then we have the AI model. So these are the different uh, language models that you can choose from. So they have recently they just updated their GPT 4.0 with the mini. And then you can use the Anthropic Claude. So they have the different ones. They have the Claude 3.5 Sun in the Opus, the Turbo. So you have all these to choose from. Uh, let's go ahead and do Sun it uh, 3.5. Uh, let's go ahead and do the haiku just for now to give you an example it uses up less of the uh, token generations so then right here we have the humanized text so you get you get to pick what uh grade level you want the article to be written so right here it says seventh grade fairly easy to read eighth grade easily understood recommended so i'll just go ahead and put that one here and then right here you would get to pick with like whatever um extra information you want to uh, add to the article and then we go down here we have the media hub so depending on how many ai images you want to write to in the article you can so you can put yes or no if you want images we're going to go ahead and do three you can even pick the style so it has all these different uh cartoon style i'm going to go ahead and leave it a none it will create the best one and then also the article size and then you can also embed a youtube video right into the article so we'll go ahead and do one and then right here is the SEO. These are the um, NLP keywords. It'll generate keywords for you or you can add your own. We'll go ahead and just click it once. If you wanted to add more, you click it again. It'll add more NLP uh, keywords. And then right here, the structure, introductory hook. You can do a question, statistics, quotation. So I'm just going to do a question and then we can customize the conclusion. If you want to add a conclusion, yes, you want tables, H3s, lists, italics, quotes, takeaways, frequently asked questions. And if you all want some of the main keywords bolded, you would put all these yes. And then if you had it uh, connected to your WordPress website, you can do some interlinking. This um, this is an update that recently SEO writing the AI did uh, before you had to pay for some extra uh, tools that were 
pretty expensive but it's already now included you can also do external links so this uh, this is a way to save time and then right here you get to choose the connect to the web so you can do none basic web deep web so the deep web if you do the deep web you can uh, get citations you can add source links so also right here you get uh, if you were looking for like real up-to-date um, information you can do real-time news so right here we have the outline editor so this is where you get to pick the outline it's going to create one for you and and then you also have the ability to make some uh, customization so i'm going to go ahead and hit magic bag and it's going to go ahead and create the outline for this article it went ahead and wrote the outline so right here we have the outline it created if we go down right here we can add more headings we can add our own we can copy and paste our own uh, outline but for right here went ahead and created one uh, it's pretty it's a pretty good outline so we're gonna go ahead and use that one and then right here at the bottom you would have the choice to publish directly to your WordPress so SEO writing does have a plugin that you can uh, add to your WordPress website that you can automatically uh, publish directly there so this will save you a lot of time even if it brings them over as drafts you can look them over already inside your website so you would just go right back to the top and once you fill this out, you would just go ahead and hit run and then it would go ahead and start running the article. So it would take a matter of a minute. So let me go ahead and let it run. It's already at 11 percent. Once it's ready, you would have this the check, the green check mark on status. So you would just click on it. And this one, we did a small article. So it wrote fifteen hundred in 53 words you can show the meta tag this is what you can use inside your article for the uh, meta title and meta description and then we have what we have here is the main uh, title we have the introductory paragraph we got the first image which is a very clean image and then we go down here we have the key takeaways and then we start getting into the article mastery meal pre planning and prep and then we have some tables here and our main keyword was meal prep hacking as you can see the youtube video I brought over meal prep hacks and then we actually have a quote from that video we got the uh, another h2 here as you go down here we can have another uh, table here uh, we have some more images as i go down you can see the article Got another image, very clean image to use. And then we come down here, we have the conclusion. And then uh, if we read this, you would, there would be a call to action. And then we have the frequently asked questions. So right here, uh, these are frequently asked questions. Uh, these are all things that we uh, did at the beginning, like I said, to create this article, answer a few of those questions. And then right here, you have the ability to just click this uh, edit button and then if you hit the edit button right in here you can make any changes it uh, it's giving you um, an overall score they have their own uh, checker in here so if i go back we have uh, i can copy this one so i can copy and paste it directly into my uh, wordpress website and then i have the html here so html you can download it and you can uh, see it. So this is what an HTML would look like if you uh, copy directly onto the web WordPress website, or I can hit this uh, publish button right here. So the publish, it'll publish it directly on to my website. So as you can see, it's not that difficult to use an AI writing tool. You just go in there, answer a few questions, and it will create the article for you and then after you can decide if you want to make any changes uh, you can read through it make sure it sounds good uh, and then if you needed to you can make changes but if you enjoyed this video please do me a favor hit that like subscribe if you have any questions please leave them in the comments and go ahead and give seo writing a try you can try it out for free i will go ahead and put a link in the description and if you happen to do sign up you can use my promo code which is Team Gym. This will get you 25% off uh, any of the plans. So thanks again. Go ahead and check this video out next.